Much speaking of weather, this is Hurricane Preparedness Week across the country and a very important time to make sure you have all the emergency supplies you would need just in case disaster strikes. Fox 54's Tori Smith spent time at the Red Cross to gather information that you need to know about preparing for hurricane season. With hurricane season starting June 1st, it's important to prep for these type of emergencies ahead of time. And this week, May 5th through the 11th, is Hurricane Preparedness Week, which is the perfect time to get everything you need of what's expected to be a very active tropical season. The start of hurricane season is just weeks away, and experts believe it will be a busy one. So now it is a good time to prepare you and your family. Although the CSRA is not on the coast, there are still a number of consequences that can follow in the event of a hurricane. We're inland here, of course, but that doesn't mean we're not, you know, at risk from from hurricanes and, and tropical storms. Um, you know, inland flooding is one of the greatest dangers associated with these systems. So you know, already understand your risk where you live. Knowing an evacuation route is critical for all weather events. However, when it comes to hurricanes, flooding is a major concern. The American Red Cross suggests getting to high grounds if your home suffers flooding, but also stay in an interior room to avoid the wind shear. We spoke with the Augusta branch of the American Red Cross about the process of preparing for a severe storm. It's really important that people go ahead and start thinking about how they can prepare for hurricane season because you don't want to try and scramble at the last minute. So that's the purpose of this week. And we really advise people to do three main things. So they need to one, build a kit, make their evacuation plan, and know how to get information and stay informed. Those are the three most important things anyone can do. Many stores have pre-made evacuation or emergency kits, but you can also make your own kit from scratch. Have your evacuation kit, you really need to make sure that you can be self-sufficient for up to three days. So that's having water, non-perishable food items, flashlights, cell phone chargers, because you might not have electricity, and then um, contact information, ways that you know that you can get in touch with people and where they may be. Remember to stay weather aware, and you can do so by downloading the Fox 54 weather app. We'll have links to the Red Cross safety kit suggestions and evacuation routes on our website. Reporting in Augusta for the National 2024 Hurricane Preparedness Week, I'm Tori Smith reporting for Fox 54.